Hey everyone, I'm Neri and this week we're gonna go shopping, looking for some fall home decor. We're gonna go to Target and Home Goods and see what they have in store. And then when we come back, I'm gonna share with you guys everything that I purchased recently for fall.
Let me know if your store looks like this, but my local Target, the section that used to have the Studio Mickey home decor has now turned into the storm section and they didn't have any other fall decor. Out of all the lines, Heart Their Hand has dropped this year. I would say their fall line was my favorite. They had so many pieces that you could use throughout the year and the colors were muted, perfect for fall. And I'm gonna start off by sharing with you guys everything that I picked up from Target. The first thing that I picked up is this small picture frame. This one was $12. Here's a better look at this picture frame. I just love the details. So the side has this gold brass color and then the front it has the black color frame. I love the shape. I've been looking for oval frames for a while now and I do love the print inside too. I'm not sure if it's removable but this is one of those items that you could use in your home any time of the year. This one is heavy. At first, I thought it was made out of wood, but it's made out of like a resin material. Another item that I picked up from the Heart Than Hand line is this decorative vase. And this one is the bigger one out of the two. This one is $30. It's a good size compared to the small one. The small one was $20. I don't think that's worth 20 but the big one is $30 and I think that's a good size. I love the color of this vase. If you look closely, you can see a couple of like dark brown spackling around it 
The only reason I picked up this base is because I don't have any base this shape or size. I like how it was narrow on the bottom, but wide on the top. It almost looks like an urn. I also love the color. Most of my bases are black or brown, and I like this tan color. That's the only reason I picked this up. Another item that I got from their line is this match holder. This is so tiny, but this one was only $3. I love the color green and this color green is a muted green it's a dark olive color I would say and then around the rims it has a brown undertone I didn't see these in store so I'm not sure if this was an online item only my husband when he saw this he thought this was a candle holder and he's like this is such a small candle holder what type of candle do you put because it's too big for a taper candle and I was like oh it's for matches this candle comes in four different scents and I got the one that's smoked apple cider. It smells, I don't know, it has like a berry smell to me. It doesn't really say what the scent notes are. The reason I picked up this candle, I really didn't need any other candle, but I love the container it comes in. This one was $13. The rest of the items that I got from Hearth and Hands line are all kitchenware items. So the first item I got is this espresso mug with the saucer how pretty is this this is giving me all the vintage vibes and this one was seven dollars i would like to purchase another one just to have a set of two but my store only had one available when i did the recording part of the video they had two and i didn't purchase it that day i went back a couple of days later i went back home i was thinking about it i was like okay i think i have to pick it up i think it's a good price for seven dollars for the set so it's basically paying $3.50 for the mug and $3.50 for the plate. I also picked up these ramekins. It's a set of three for $10. So they come up to be $3.50 for each of them. A little less, around like $3.33. The only negative thing I would say is that these are kind of small. I wish they were a little bigger. So I picked these up because the last Sunday of every month we do family brunch. To go with the brunch, we do dips and... I thought these would be really pretty to use as dips, and I like that it comes with the lid. I love the colors. I feel you could use this any time of the year, especially this one right here. The cream color is very neutral. And the green color you could also use any time of the year. And even this orange color, it doesn't really scream fall because it's not that bright orange. It's a muted orange. So this whole set, you could use any time of the year. You could use it for dips or even for toppings like if you do hot cocos you could put marshmallows sprinkles little mini chocolate chips you could use it for stuff like that another way you could use it is you could actually use them for salt and peppers if you like the color and put a little spoon inside that's a great way to use them too i love how the line it complements each other if you look at this uh, little espresso cup set this matches the design on these ramekins so well and i love having decor in my house especially kitchenware that matches and it feels like it's part of a set so everything just goes together i picked up the salt and pepper grinders the small one was ten dollars and the taller one was thirteen dollars it was so hard finding a set i ordered these for delivery and when arrived i did not like the color the cap was completely different color compared to the base of it. Went in the store to see if they have more. They were all like that. All of them had the base, the cap that was gold, and the base was copper. I tried to find the best one that matched. You guys see the color difference? The, they're not the same shade. It's one of those items that you just wanted it, so you picked them up, and I thought the price wasn't that bad either. $23 for the set, that's a great price. The next two items that I got from the Hearth and Hand line are kitchen towels. So this one is a, this one is $4 and this is called a flower sack kitchen towel. You can hang these on your hooks or peg hooks if you have. The reason I picked up this one is to use it as a cafe curtain. I normally buy the towels that Hearth and Hand carries, the flower towels like this, and I use them to hang on my peg hooks. Let me open it up so I can show you guys the design. So I like the striped looks and I like the color. It has green and blue. I think these will make really pretty cafe curtains. Just imagine this hanging on one window like this. 
I only picked up one item from Home Goods. This item that I got from Home Goods is this vase. I think it's heavy and huge. This vase was $40. And this one is a look for less. The original one is a vintage vase and they go for a I think $120. So to find this one for $40, this one is huge. And I love the color. It's a dark green color with a little bit of brown undertone. I'm gonna hold this here because this is heavy. I saw someone on Instagram sharing that they found this one at Home Goods, and I went to Home Goods. I, I would say at least two times to look for it. The, when I went to go do the shop with me for fall decor, that's when I found this, and I was like, ah, oh, it's meant to be. I have to take it home. They only had one, and I cannot wait to share with you guys how I style this for fall. But this is one of those items that I'm gonna use all year long. It's gonna be on my entryway table. This color green is perfect. This is not really fall decor, but I have to share with you guys this piece right here. If you are looking for this type of vase, definitely check out your home goods. I believe they have a smaller one that's $30, but I did not find that one at my store. My local home goods, they were just starting to put out fall decor. I didn't really need any more fall decor. The fall decor that I'm purchasing this year are more kitchenware items and I mostly needed some new throw pillows and florals and that's what I really bought this year for fall. I found this pillow at Kohl's a couple of months ago and I got this on clearance for nine dollars and if you just saw my shop with me portion of home goods they had a similar pillow like this for twenty five dollars. I'm gonna insert that video part right here so you can see it and compare the two decor is already affordable but I do feel their pillows are expensive so I stay away from buying throw pillows from home goods I always purchase throw pillow covers from Amazon I don't really need pillows I just want the pillow cover so I always buy my pillow covers from Amazon this pillow cover I already put like a little pillow inside of it so I'm just gonna show you guys this one was from Amazon and this one was under seven dollars it has the perfect vintage look. I've always wanted a throw pillow like this and I love the design. The colors of the florals is perfect for fall and this gives me that amber interior vibe. If you look at the colors, this pillow cover was under $7. I'll have it linked in my captions for you guys. Another pillow cover I got from Amazon are these olive colored throw pillow covers. They come on a set of two for $10. French look on the end of the pillow is really pretty too but I really love the color. If you were to purchase similar throw pillows like these from Home Goods, it'd probably be around $25 to $30 for the set. And I got the throw pillow covers for $10 for two. If you are looking for throw pillows to purchase for fall, check out my Like to Know It shop. I will have a link below so you can find similar items for a fraction of the price just like me. A couple of weeks ago, I shared with you guys my Michael's Shop With Me video. Make sure you check that out. It will be linked in the caption section. I said I would go back and buy the turkey decor and that's exactly what I did. So I picked up the small one. This one was $15 and I purchased these fall decor was 40% off this one came out to be around $8 and it's just a decorative item it has no purpose but I just love the design if you look closely it has like this little burgundy brown undertone to it from far away oh no it's not from far away it really does have glitter I was just I was about to say from far away it looks like it has a little shimmer look but maybe that's just the look but no it's actually glitter. I hate glitter. I hate glitter. It just gets everywhere, but I'm just gonna hold this from the bottom. I'm just gonna hold this from the bottom so I don't get glitter anywhere else. But I, oh my God, if I knew this had glitter, I don't think I would have picked this up. I'm gonna use this for styling on a shelf and I won't really be touching it. So I guess it's okay that it has little glitter. And then I did pick up this plate right here. This one comes in two different designs. They have the bigger turkey, and this is like the baby turkey. I went with this one. This one original was $10. And then with the 40% off, this one came out to be $6. I love the color right here with the florals, just brown florals. Let me share with you guys a plate that I thrifted a couple of months ago that looks so similar to this. 
here's the bowl that I thrifted. It's like a plate bowl. A couple of months ago, I thrifted this for $2. And I think these look so similar. I picked up a total of four of these little stems. They were a dollar each. I put two inside that planter. They're little mini wild daisies. And I really like them. Even though these are part of their fall line, I think you could keep them out any time of the year. They don't look cheap at all. For $1, I think this is a great find. And the last couple of things that I got from Michaels, they're part of a set. This is an artichoke bowl, and this one was $10. So with 40% off, they came out, this one came out to be $6. And then I bought the other items that was part of the set. I bought the small platter. This one was also $10 are looking for these items they're part of the line called gift things and this is the bigger one this one is $13 but remember that all of these items were 40% off originally I wasn't going to pick up the big one I wanted to just get the small one I want to use the small one as a spoon rest I ended up picking up the big one because they only had one left and I was like what if I change my mind and when I come back they don't have it don't you guys get that vintage vibe when you see these pieces? I love how Michael's decor always has that vintage vibe. You're buying brand new decor, but it has that perfect aesthetic that I'm going for. Hope you enjoyed today's video. Let me know in the comment section what you purchased for fall so far. How are you styling your home this year? Do you have a theme in mind? I'm not really sure if I have a theme in mind. I'm just picking up pieces that I like, and I can't wait to play around with my decor and see what I come up with. All right, guys, that's going to be it for today's video. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you guys next week for another video. Bye for now.